Has our local real estate market officially shifted to a buyer's market? How did the banking crisis affect the interest rates? And uh, what do you get when you cross a dog with a calculator? A friend you can count on. Hi, I'm Ron Pepka with Team Pepka at Keller Williams on the Water, and this is your 122nd Minnesota Market Moment. It's the show where I share the top real estate headlines in 120 seconds or less. Let's go! Welcome back. A sudden banking crisis has caused a decline in mortgage rates. After the failures of Silicon Valley Bank and Signature Bank in the recent days, the average bank loan rate fell, according to Bank Rates National Survey of Large Lenders. This turmoil went global, sending equity markets tumbling and sparking renewed calls for the Federal Reserve to pause its monetary policy tightening efforts when officials meet next week. Not so fast. While the market pricing was volatile this week, Traders feel that there's an 85% chance the Fed will still increase the rate another 0.25% when they meet. If you're buying a home or refinancing, it would be a great time to lock your rate. Real estate markets across the country have shifted. How about Florida? Many hopeful buyers are wondering, is it a buyer's market yet? Well, numbers don't lie and they do indicate a shift. Inventory from the same quarter as last year rose an incredible 372.2% and sales fell 23.1%. The median price rose 8.7% quarter to quarter but fell 10% from the peak of last October to $490,000. And even with the inventory increases, it remained a slight seller's market at a 3.3 month supply. What it means for buyers is there are more choices and less multiple offer situations. However, if you're financing, the interest rates will be higher than last year. Sellers, well, you can still sell your home at top dollar. However, it might not be quite as high as last year and you may have to negotiate just a little bit. Whether you're a buyer or a seller, if you have questions about the market and your place in it, please reach out. We're here to help. If you have questions about financing, please reach out to our partner in the business, Candace Copeland at Bank of England. Today's conventional rate is at 6.25%. FHA and VA are quoted at 6%. Please be sure to ask Candace about her special 2-1 buy down. Well, that's all for this month. Remember, spring is a time of renewal, fresh starts, new projects, setting new goals, and making positive changes in your life. Be the best version of yourself. Stay true to your values and what brings you a sense of happiness. Happiness is most often found on the journey to achieving your goals. From our family to yours, stay safe and be well.